<coughs> pretty high-end, basic high-end PC. X58 motherboard, Asus Rampage 2, running in Core i7-960 at 3.2, 6 gig of RAM, Windows 7 64, no overclocking, nothing special. On the right side, so the only difference between those two systems is the GPU. This one is running a single GTX 285 with 1 gig, standard 285. This one on the left is running a GF100. It is not a final card, so it is not final performance that we're showing, it's not the final specs, so the final results will be better than what we're showing. And we're going to start with just running a Far Cry 2 benchmark. That is a normal Far Cry 2 benchmarking tool, normal patch game, running wrench small, run it two times in a loop, set it to DirectX 10, 19 by 12 resolution for XAA, ultra high settings, and the only driver settings I did was forcing anisotropic filtering to 60 nex. Because you, I cannot expose it here in, in these settings, want to make sure this standard public resolution 1080p for XAA 16 AF. You guys have probably never seen this before, so I'm not sure. <laughs> 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 so it is just the standard settings, just set it up. Uh, AI is on, so it is basically the standard benchmark you have in Part Ray 2. I'm just okay, going to so fire it up on both systems. Some sound too. Ah, here we go. The system on the left is loading a little bit faster for some reason. <laughs> So you can see here right from the beginning the frame rate counter. Here we start way over 100 frames per second while on the GTX 85 we have about in the 50, 60 frames per second range. Of course the characters, the AI can be different. The AI is active so you might see a character on the right side not on the left side but you guys know that in Far Cry 2 benchmarking. Here's another example of frame rate, over 110 here, you're in about 50, 60 frames per second area. Well, that was loop one, now it's going to do another loop, just to make sure everything is cached and running fine. See where the chicken is. There's the chicken. Is he gonna live? Yeah. <laughs> That's the most entertaining part of this benchmark. When you do benchmarking, always have a look on what happens with the chicken. Now it's running running away, but yeah, it got that one. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so here we are, the GTX 285 it scores about 50.3 frames a second in an average and on G100 we end up with about 84.2 so 84 frames per second average frame rate, so that's quite a significant difference. Also on the minimum frame rate, you can see it's a huge difference in frame rate. 45, what's it showing on you? 285? 